before this movie main event, I want to bring up a matter of a great importance. So you know how in each GNOME update, shell extensions break. Don't you? Well, not exactly. You see, some extensions were failing, when others would keep working, and that was bringing confusion and uncertainty to people. But in GNOME 45 this major issue is finally solved. Because in GNOME 45, every single extension will be broken, without any exceptions. Ha! Consistency! So, on Shell main branch right now, what's expected to become 45, extensions are giving an import error. Which means we're finally moving to ESM, and extensions are loaded as modules already. Much highly anticipated work, that eventually will make every Shell and extensions developer life a bit easier. Obviously, the upstream extensions have been updated to ESM already. Just saying, if you want to check the code perhaps. And speaking of the upstream extensions, we have the introduction of a new extension that set us the light theme or the dark, depending the global settings. To be honest, I'm not sure if the shell light theme will be activated from settings the same way it is for the apps. Like a single global switch. At the moment, the extension can only set the light theme, so we can mix dark apps with light shell. However, Florian on Merge Request has posted a screenshot with extension settings that give us options to either follow system preferences or to force either style we want. Dark or light? That makes me to believe that maybe the settings switch will also affect the shell theme. So if we set dark apps, we also get dark shell, and if we set light apps, we'll also get light shell. But I really don't know what's gonna happen. One thing sure, the app shell menu is finally dead. 